Okay, um, I am Lawrence White. I am your instructor for English 103. This is a little um, uh, preparation video. Here, let me see if you get more of the future. Okay, there's me. <laughs> there I am. Um, this is a little introduction to the, the class uh, video. Give you an overview of what kind of things that we're going to be doing and what I'm expecting from you. Okay, and this is what I look like in real life. Um, you'll be seeing more of these videos so you get you'll get more of a view more of a view of my wonderful ness okay um, so let's start are we is this the um, it's the okay so I think then we're getting the um, you guys are seeing this slideshow here I certainly hope so I'm um, this is my second um, quarter with canvas so I'm not 100% up to speed on it um, but uh, please bear with me, and I think we'll work things out. Okay, so here's a slideshow. Uh, welcome to English 103 with Mr. White, um, Mr. Lawrence White. I'm adjunct faculty here at Tacoma Community College. My office is in 18202. If you want to meet in real life, uh, message me, and we can schedule an appointment. My Roughly my availability would be between 8.30 in the morning and 2.30 in the afternoon, so I've got a fairly wide range of availability. I've been teaching at TCC for more than 10 years, and I love teaching composition. I like teaching this class. Okay, uh, this presentation is about what I will ask you to do. So these are the things, the assignment type things that you're going to be expected to do in this class. It is your responsibility to know how to do them. Okay, in other words, you are responsible for knowing how to use Canvas. I am not an expert at Canvas. Um, you just saw this video is sort of evidence of the limits of my ability. Um, you have to make sure you take advantage of all the kinds of this training opportunities presented to you. The school gives you plenty of tutorials and things like that to figure out how to do things in Canvas. Um, you're responsible for being able to, to do them. Okay? Um, now, how do you know what these things I want you to do are? Okay, there's two ways to do it. Main way is through the modules. Okay, there will be a new module every week in this class, and that module will have all the um, activities and assignments for that week will be available as soon as the module opens up. The module will open up every every week, and so that's the the main way. Uh, you'll know how to do. Also, there's going to be a schedule in the syllabus. I'm um, thinking that given the schedule today, I might not be able to get the syllabus posted um, exactly um, before noon because they're doing some portal uh, development. But um, the shortly later today, I'll have the syllabus available for you, and it'll have a schedule in the back of it, a rough schedule there. Okay. Uh, the main thing, this is a writing class, so the main things you're doing in this class are writings, okay? Um, they will break down into six paragraphs in MLA format about poems, one three-page argument paper in MLA format, uh, no secondary sources required, about a play, one two-page research report in APA format about an author, and finally one four-page research paper in MLA format with four additional sources about a story. Okay, so that's basically um, the writing for the for the quarter okay in the next 11 weeks okay uh, for the two argument papers and the research report you will turn in a draft which I will comment on then you will revise and turn in as the paper okay so you do a draft first you'll get extensive comments from me we'll do peer reviews on it and then you'll turn in the final version uh, for the paper grade okay to get the full benefit now this is a tricky part we have had I last quarter was my first quarter with canvas and uh, there were some issues uh, with people giving me uploading drafts that I could not comment on because of the formatting, okay, or having problems getting the, the files um, uploaded. To get the full benefit of my comments, you have to upload the submission correctly. Uh, so again, look at the Canvas training to, to get instruction on how to do that. I make comments on the paper and on the side of the paper, and you have to read both kinds of comments when you revise your paper. So there's going to be comments kind of like in a discussion format on the side, uh, but there are also going to be specific comments specifically about um, on the paper itself, highlighted words, um, comments that are pointed that point to specific places 
in the in your paper um, some things written directly on the paper you're gonna have to read those comments also to do a full revision and you're gonna have to upload uh, the, the the file correctly so that I can put the comments on it okay um, unit announcements the writing assignments paragraphs three page argument research report four page argument and secondary sources are divided into units four units at the beginning of each unit there will be an announcement listing all the assignments for that unit so that will be another way you, you fit, are told what's expected of you okay now another big thing we're going to do is discussions um, if you're familiar with Canvas, this is a big thing we do in, in discussions. Some of these will be what you would call a discussion proper about the readings. I will be asking questions about the readings, reading prompts. You'll be posting um, responses to my questions. You'll be resp posting responses to other things that um, students have said, posts of students. I will join in these discussions and I will have responses to what you said and you will respond to me. Uh, so lots of discussion. That should be good. Uh, some of these discussions, though, will be exercises. Uh, so things I'm going to ask you to write uh, along a small exercise, uh, along the lines of a small exercise, um, grammar and mechanics exercises, formatting, etc. You will have a minimum of 72 hours availability to participate in discussions. Okay, so once discussions become open, you'll have three full days to participate in the discussion. After that time, however, you cannot post. Once the discussions are closed, they're done. So you, all of you should be able to do what you need to do in the discussions in a three-day window. Okay? Quizzes. There will be short quizzes on the syllabus and on readings. Uh, these, of course, will be open book. And these also will be available for a minimum of 72 hours, but cannot be made up after they are closed. Okay? Um, and then here's some additional items, and this is mostly stuff, ways of me getting information to you. Uh, one is announcements. I will be making um, announcements all throughout the quarter, talking about uh, important things. For example, those unit assignment sheets are going to be um, part of an, are going to be announcements, uh, stuff like that. So that's the main way uh, that I communicate with you guys. All right. Uh, videos. Okay. For example, this video that I've made here, I'm going to be making videos throughout the quarter. Um, these will be first on Tegrity. Now I say that for now because supposedly someone told me that Tegrity is going away within um, within a um, week or so. I that sounds really um, ambitious to me. I don't know when, but at some point they're going to switch over to some new system. I forget what it's called, um, but but so there will not be Tegrity videos. Um, another way, though, all the videos I put on Tegrity, I'm also going to upload to YouTube. I think YouTube's easier um, to look at. Um, for most people, not all uh, hardware setups um, on your computers support integrity. So I'm going to do the YouTube videos also. Um, files, I will, um, information files, so like assignment sheets, um, but also um, files on specific um, things I'm looking for. Um, so on uh, punctuation rules, um, paragraph, for, um, Models. There's a specific model of paragraphing that I'm going to be teaching you this quarter. There'll be a file on that. All sorts of things I will refer to in, like, for example, in comments that I put on your paper, you will you will be able to look back on these files for, for a deeper explanation of what exactly I mean. Um, and then finally, um, you can message me and you can email me. So message me through the Canvas, but also email me. Now, but the important thing is email me to my... Um, Tacoma email address. Okay, from your, it works best. The world goes best if you email me from your Tacoma email account and email to my uh, Tacoma uh, account. And there's my address there, lwhite at tacomacc.edu. Okay, thank you for um, listening to this uh, video, and I, I expect that we're going to have a good time and learn lots of things this quarter in this class. Okay, and there we go.